Let me be real about something. I am a parent and I want my child to succeed in life in ways that I could not have imagined. And I understand that it starts with the instructor and being able to be taught. Five reasons we need to reappreciate these teachers. Part two. Number one, it seems to me that teachers have become punching bags. Now, a lot of videos have gone viral over the last couple of months of students fighting teachers. Students entering teacher spaces with curse words and violence and physicality. And now these teachers are beginning to defend themselves and people are outraged. Teach your child to stay in a child's place. Teach your child to be respected. Teach your child to bring any issues with an adult back to an adult. Because you are putting a person back against the wall when this six foot two, 330 pound Line and get in my face and say the wrong thing to me, and I'm supposed to be in this right. I'm gonna rock you, march these down on him. Number two, people who are not in the classroom keep dictating how teachers should teach. I am extremely close to some instructors, and they are telling me how they are instructing in the thing the states and the local governments are telling them to do and how to instruct our children. And we wonder why our kids come home confused as hell, and our kids are getting everything through an email and everything on a laptop. Teachers are not allowed to teach anymore. I'm not talking about the curriculum they're allowed to teach. I'm talking about the way they are allowed to teach. My teacher told me, Josh, use your hand if you can't count. Nowadays, they want you to use a pencil or a tree or a car or be thumb on what the hell. Let teachers instruct how they instruct. This is why you hired them in the first place. Number three, we want these teachers to give their lives for our kids, but we won't pay them a little bit more money. I am an honest tax paying citizen. I do not know where my taxes are going. I don't know what streets are being built. I don't know where the funds are allocated. But I do know teacher salary. Why? Because a teacher's salary is public record. You can Google your teacher's salary in your community right now. Now, times are changing where violence is running rampant and it's a sick and disgusting world. And we expect these teachers to sacrifice their life, but we won't even show up to a PTA meeting or we won't even support them getting any kind of raises. We have to do better for those who are out of the educational system and we want better education for our children can we please at least bare minimum support a pay increase number four your favorite instructor today probably has two or three jobs and they don't complain to you contrary to popular belief teaching does not start when the bell rings and end when the bell rings teacher starts a couple hours before, and they had that school a couple hours after. And y'all thinking, they get summers off, they get spring break, they get all the time in the world. What do they got to complain about? Teachers don't get paid enough. They don't get days off because they have extra jobs because they run out of teaching stuff, so they have to use their own money to buy shit. And number five, teachers only get appreciated on teacher appreciation days, only get told thank you when your child is doing well. Last week, I got called into the teacher's office because they said my son was talking too much. I told that teacher to his face, you be yourself. You reprimand my son how you got to reprimand my son. And you let me know if he get out of line and I'll take care of him at home in ways that only his father can take care of him. I appreciate the teacher. I appreciate the instructor. I appreciate the fact that they are creating AI technology trying to replace human interaction. And I hope it fails on every single level because our children, to tomorrow's future, the leaders need human interaction. They need to understand how to work with people, how to communicate with people, how to work with various and different backgrounds. And no Nobody can do that other than the instructor. I've said this before, and I'm going to say this again. Your favorite judge, your favorite lawyer, your favorite cop, your favorite athlete, at one point or another, was educated by a teacher. Jesus, the most perfect man on this earth, was a carpenter and a teacher in the end of his life. He taught outside. The building meant nothing. My name is Josh Prey, and you should appreciate, thank, and tag your favorite teacher. Damn.